Hello guys, it's Mongai Eve. Tuko hapa na Otile Black. Eh, kibera kuna Otile Black. Hii namba nane itanionyesha maneno. Otile? Yeah, yeah. Eh, unasema jina ni Otile Black. Yeah, Otile Black iko na history like eh. from way back. Otile Brown and Ajua the whole story. Ot- uh, Ot- yeah, we were actually a group. Mhm. So, uh tulikuwa tunajita Otile Gang. Mhm. Uh, tukakuwa na issues kidogo uh, when was this kuna mwingi kwa industry kitambo aje eh, nimekuwa kwa industry for long it's been uh, mm. hey, almost 8 years wow. yeah uh-huh. so we we were a group and uh, tulikuwa na issues kidogo uh-huh. uh, tuka split so na just since ni otile brown i was otile black uh-huh. so by the way kila mtu sema sijina kwa pigina yeah that is the story tulikuwa uh-huh. group hata tuko na ma song uh-huh. Yeah, to jarili. Is the songs oh, as yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, so that's why you got the name Otile Black. Kuna jamii na kikwanga like guy. Ama huyu mtu anataka gigi na Otile Brown? Ah, uh, no, 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 no. Like from way back, manzi. Okay. So, yeah. There is another name tena nimeangalia kwa mtandao tena nimeanza kuona unajiita Chali wa Kibera. Which is which now? Mbona una msimamo? Ah, uh, unajua Otile Black ni jina watu wa mtaa wanaijua like yani mm-hmm. ni ile jina watu wa mtaa wanajua wanajua tulikuwa group mm-hmm. wananiambia mbona mfanyi collab na umse mm-hmm. una get so mm-hmm. chali wa kibera mimi ni msaw kibera so yeah. i mean pia na management wa kibera so, so i mean so uko na ujite manzaki me chali wa kibera pia wewe <laughs> yeah yeah for anyway sure. it's nice umesema umetaja hapo yani manager wa manzi wa kibera umeanza lini ku manage Ah uh, acha tu ni set record straight tukianza kwa kuna mazo ya kibera uh, mm. atuko na contract or anything mm-hmm. unaona nilikuwa tu na advice mm. na mpeleka photo shoots mm-hmm. i take care of the bills unawana. when was this uh, this was like one year ago so it's before the a blue hii mambo na yeah this before year. yeah before manzo ya kibera kwa popular mm-hmm. yeah. so ushila black tumesikia jina ilitoka wapi tusikwe na tusiko tukishanga hii jina na utile black imetoka wapi anyway umetaja hapo that umekuwa mkiwa na manzo wa kibera kama manager wake yeah. when did it start uh, it started like one year ago mhm uh, haiku official but nilikuwa na advice because nimekuwa kwa industry mm-hmm. Uh, nilikuwa namwambia vitu anaweza fanya na mpeleka mm-hmm. photo shoots mm-hmm. na mpeleka video shoots okay so yeah. by then alikuwa na do alikuwa alikuwa nani kwa game like okay by that time akuwa na high pivo mm-hmm. ona get there was a time nilimpeleka video shoot ya pose last year oh so she was a video queen yeah she was a video queen mm-hmm. yeah so uh, with time nikaanza ku advice na mwambia I think pay na faukwe unaongelea vitu zina happen kwa street ju manzo wa kibera at first hako mm-hmm. anataka julikana na toka kibera mm-hmm. nikamwambia maybe hiyo ndi inaweza fanya watu wakupende kukuwa mm-hmm. tu maril mm-hmm. yeah so mm-hmm. okay yeah. how has it been kwa kna efu ania manzo wa kibera alikuwa dempoa na mpigia simu anashika mm-hmm. uh, tulikuwa tu poa unaona so mm-hmm. Of late vile cafe mkameingia kidogo. Mambo inaanza ku change. Eh mambo ina change sana. Before tufike hapo like unajua umekuwa na mambo ya kibera tukimuona time tumeanza ku tumeanza I mean approach tumeanza kufanya interviews and everything then akafika time ameingia with material. How was the feeling? By then mlikuwa mshaanza kusema now wewe you are the official manager ama bado eh. ilikuwa ile afya na advice. Okay by that time uh tulibambika mm-hmm. because alisema wow yani finally mm-hmm. vitu zina happen you know so um, we were very excited mm-hmm. atukongelea mambo ya management and everything mm-hmm. but alikuwa ananiambia eh hey, we sasa ni manager mm-hmm. naona we can work una mm-hmm. get yeah. okay have you ever signed any contract as a manager okay I'll be honest atuna contract unaona mimi mm-hmm. nilikuwa best ya manzo wa kibera nili nimelipia photo shoots nime spend uh, nime spend karibu 60k kwa photo shoots zake mimi I'm going to invest on her <laughs> yeah, I've invested a lot so mm-hmm. uh, nil, nil, nilikuwa na, na look up to her sana una mm-hmm. get because ni, uh-huh, uh-huh. Uh, because nilijua the moment alinge recommend uh, 
alikuwa poa but vile alitoka of late jo mm-hmm. eh manzo okay. kiberacha hizo sasa ni kuulize the reason uli amua kuwa na manzo kibera what was the big reason inye ili amua you going to work with this lady ju it's very inakuanga very hard kwa mua utawak na huyu mtu uta hard to invest on her yet you don't know how the cash is going to come in return uli okay. amua kama that you going to work with her Uh, okay me kwa watu wa juu mimi ni msani na mimi ni manager so mm-hmm. manzi wa kibera si wa kwanza kuna mm-hmm. msichana nime manager anaitwa Munira mm-hmm. ame msichana anatanga maudhini huyo mm-hmm. bado uh, ni video queen huyo ni video queen so, so mm-hmm. uh, when manzi wa kibera nili meet mm-hmm. uh, it, it was not at the, ako poa yendi anaweza yeah. but alikuwa anaitaka sana oh alikuwa anatamani sana kukuwa alikuwa na hiyo hanga so sometimes hiyo mm. hanga ndi na drive mtu mtu mm. anaweza kuwa talented but ana drive so manzi wa kibera alikuwa na drive anajituma na mm-hmm. mimi nataka so, tuwa kama manzi okay. acha kunilenga so so in short wewe una managing ma vixen Yeah, I manage video vixens, models. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's what I do. Okay, now that you are an artist, where do you get the cash to support these ladies? Uh, I'm a businessman. Oh, uh, apart uh, from kukwa msanii bado. Huko Kibera pia unapata uko na kibanda ya nyanya pale. Mm-hmm. Unauza kitunguu hapa, mm-hmm. makaa hapo. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm a businessman. Mm-hmm. Si drive Range Rover but huko Kibera ni kwa na biashara, mabitungu, okay. tomato. That's when I Okay now manzo wa kibera kuna watu unajua apart from kusikia wewe ni manager wake nini the time tulianza kufanya videos i could see some comments oh ati ah we dips ni yule de mama wa wa utile black oh dems ni nini nini the time we kwa mke wake naye have you ever been into a love relationship uh, manzo wa kibera unajua ni msichana anapendeza na mm unajua unaweza ah, <laughs> hey, unajua unaweza kuwa na temptation mm-hmm. saa zingine anatembea mbele yako mm-hmm. unajua hata alisema nuona mali eh, no kukula labda si ukula lunch pamoja mm-hmm. yeah, lakini hiyo yeah. mali bado hujaguza hiyo eh, mali hiyo mali unajua lazima ni heshimu labda labda akinipatia permission but ni job ni job tuko okay. job okay so there is nothing like love relationship uh, there is nothing like love relationship but tulikuwa marafiki sana you are just close friends eh, but oh. ustai na mbadilisha sasa eh, unajua mkikuwa my best friend kwanza boy na dem kwa kuangana yako kwa possibility kwa kukwaenda una mali so hapa tutakuamini <laughs> Ah una jua. Then pia utule black. Kwani inaweza kuwa wewe si mtu mzuri? Juu pia hiyo umetaja Munira na pia nishawe isikia Ruma. So unajua mimi spend spend Ruma that's why unaona tumewa kna yeye for long almost eh hey, some months ni yeah. months mob. Yeah. Na bado sijai kuuliza bado nishawe isikia Ruma. Wewe wewe kwani ma vixen wenye una manage. Okay unajua hii ni story ya pasta. Hakuna vile utakula kondo. Unajua mm-hmm. like eh ni job uwezi haribu kazi unaharibu kazi because sasa mm. mm. eh ni job unajua okay uh. okay manzo wa kibera ni dem nimekuwa nikiona hata before inge wa ismachirio na before watu wamjue should get some gigs kama kwa club vitu kama hizo wewe kama manager do you get your share ama inakuanga aje how is your business uh. wewe unapata wewe unasaidika aje kwa hii biashara Okay me you know my manager so obvious mm. najua the business side of it. Oh. Uh, so unapata kienda video shoots, akienda hizo club appearance. Obvious kuna ka down payment na mimi naweza chukua yangu kidogo, mm-hmm. anachukua kidogo. But yeah. of late yani mm-hmm. hata nikipata deal sataki ku, kuenda. Hataki kuonekana. Anasema anataka deal za mm. six figures kama mm. kama Ar- vile juzi ya barabara amepata deal ya omo anasema mm. Anasema nataka deals za 60. But you know it has to start from somewhere. Yeah. yeah. It was a fake one. Akupata <laughs> homo. Anyway, ke umesema at least at least hapo ni make the business side of the story. Unajua pia mtu hawezi kuwa tu na unalisha kitu yenye kusaidi. Yeah, uh, manze, yeah, very true. For the true. for the time kwa mkiwak before ata upload. What is the main challenge yenye mkiwa mkifes both of you? Uh, number one, main challenge uh, manzo wa kibera kianza alikuwa ratchet mm-hmm. pictures ilikuwa crazy mm-hmm. so kuna deal mingi sana tulikosa mm-hmm. una get mpaka to a point where mm-hmm. 
e, mamake akikaa makiongelea <laughs> e, hata kuna time aliniambia wewe pia ule advice mazo kibera hizi <laughs> picha kuna vile zinaweza kutoa kwa deals <laughs> yeah so since anze ku, ku change kuji brand <laughs> Uh, sama wanapata deals so okay. the biggest challenge was uh, alikuwa na jina but deals ilikuwa kidogo because gone. now uh, watu watu wanaogopa hiyo brand ilikuwa okay. too ratchet if you, if you may ask the time yenye alianza ku blow mbona mbona mlitik so long kuanza ku rebrand why was it that you took so long uh, You know Manzo Kibera before blow mm-hmm. alikuwa na around 8000 followers. I remember. Alikuwa mm-hmm. na two followers. So yeah. uh ili to take long ku brand because uh iyo uoga it was something new. So mm-hmm. uh, alikuwa ile position like to ki brand na ikata. Uh, mbona tusibaki? So mm-hmm. there was back and forth. So kulikuwa na ako disagreement. Eh, kulikuwa tulikuwa na disagreement na kumbuka that time hmm. atukuongea for like almost two weeks. So where we will kuna try kumwambia you supposed eh, to be. Eh yeah nilikuwa na try. Okay me you know I'm a businessman. So namwambia you know I've spent a lot of money on you uh, everything transport nini uh, this is my chance kupata profit. Hmm. So kama lazima brand ndio tupate profit mm, then tufanye hivyo. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay, sasa so far kutoka mwanza kwa kina yeye unasema you've spent around 60k. 80k. 80 80g's. 80g's. Ushai like umefika ile position ya ya kurudisha pesa unajua lazima mtu afanye kazi na ukijua lazima utapata ka profit in some time umepata uh, profit ama bado I'll be honest mwanzo wa kibera vile alitoka wife material mm-hmm. uh, alianza kupata ma deal mm-hmm. so nikaanza kuona ah hii investment yangu italipa what are some of the deals zenye ashaipata uh, deals anapata kiba unapata anafanya musician challenge oh. ya ku dance mm-hmm. video appearance yeah. club appearance mm-hmm. unapata na mention watu una get like mm. there's a lot of support unaona yeah. mm. eh, so uh, apparently of late manzia me change unaona so, so hata hiyo faida yangu sipati ushai rudi umerudisha hiyo doa ama bado dosi jarudisha ndio maana hata mm. nashindwa sasa mm-hmm. si basa ngoje nirudishe hata some cash alafu <laughs> eh. okay umeko uki complain na bado hujatuambia the story kwani what's happening right now are you not uh, in good terms so manzi wa kibera eh, somewhere back kidogo mm-hmm. alinipigia simu mm-hmm. ananiambia after wife material eh hey, after wife material ananiambia mbona size ita kwa na deal ya pampas mm-hmm. mbona sijui nani yako na deal ya homo mm-hmm. unaona mbona si mimi zina <laughs> eh hey, anasema sijui mbona Eriko Mondi sijui yako na deal ya William Loso wewe wewe unajua Eriko hey, kuna mingi eh hey, yeah, so ananiambia Yeah. Mbona unaniletea madeal za video shoot club? Mm-hmm. Mimi nataka gari, unaona? Yeah. So mpaka anaza kuniambia you know, mimi najua tumetoka mbali but mm. nataka manager atafanya niende showroom ninunue. Actually mazo oh. kibera nataka Lexus. Oh, so her idea. Lexus, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Lexus is about a uh, is it 8 million ama 8? Wewe, like my dream car, the one that I love, it's Lexus X570. Yeah. It's around 19M. So manzo akibera nataka Lexus. Ananiambia I want a manager mwenye atafanya ni buy Lexus. Okay. Mbona Diamond ana ana ni ambassador wa Pepsi. Okay. So, so nikamwambia yeah, mm-hmm. acha tu brand, acha tu brand alafu ndajikaza nitafute hizi deal. Mhm. Uh, akaniambia sawa akakata. So uh, immediately kuna mtu alikol akaniambia ni aje nataka manzo akibera kwa video. Mm-hmm. Ku call manzo akibera simu ingi. Nikangoja wana hawa na call tena simu ingi. Okay. Nikasema acha ni mdm. Kwenda mm-hmm. Instagram ameni unfollow, ameni block siezi tu message. Mm-hmm. Unaona? So sasa hii yani it's been it's been like a week. Mm-hmm. Nimeshindwa ku reach kabisa. Okay. So my question is kwa hiyo story ya manager. I remember back then when Manzo Kibera alianza ku blow, Mwalimu Recho alimapproach in the in the nini in the name of kukuwa manager wake iliendaje yet uh, unajua wewe ndo ulikuwa manager by then iliendaje you didn't come to an agreement ama what happened uh, actually there was an agreement but mm-hmm. now mm-hmm. mazo kibera alikuwa anataka mm-hmm. atimini kuwe photographer wake mhm atiacha huyu akwe manager 
Mhm. Au ulikuwa unataka eh, Mimi ndio manager. Una... Sasa na mwalimu Recho pia alikuwa anataka kazi ya manager. Kwa nini mtakuwa manager wawili? Eh, sasa labda yeye pia aliona kama hezi kuwa manager mm. na hatuwezi kuwa manager wawili. Mm. So I think uh, Mgunga kwa assistant manager. Eh hey, ama ama si, uh, but I think Manza Kibera ako na mm. unaja Manza Kibera tumezoeana sana mm-hmm. mpaka mm. eh Labda ni mezana na manager wangu eh, ni Masoel. Eh, so labda na na wesi manager mm-hmm. because unaona tuko kwa serious hiyo. Okay. Me feel like maybe ungekubali hiyo deal ya mwalimu Rachel unajua mwalimu Rachel maybe yako na hiyo nini? Anaweza ingia uto tumachuo. Maybe that's the reason manzo wa Kibera ameamua ameamua kukasirika. Eh hey, unajua mimi. Nani alikata hiyo story mke wawili? Una unajua nilimwambia ndakuaje ndakuaje photographer na Kwa hivyo ni uti baba uti leno wewe ulikataa. Sasa unaona sasa unajua mpaka ananirushia maneno ananiambia mm. ah unajua hata mm. hata labda kuna watu ume, umefanya waende na wangefanya ninunue Lexus. Mm. Ju I'll be honest wasani wasania walipi hivyo there yeah, are very yeah. few wenye wanalipa vizuri. Na sajua wewe kumbe kwa kubayo. Eh hakuna show. Sam sania anakuambia kuna mpaka msanii mkubwa juzi amepiga simu ati atalipa 500. <laughs> Unaona? Akaniambia bro mimi ningelipa hata 10k lakini hakuna mm. kitu. Mm. Unaona? So mwanzo wa Kibera ananiambia sasa ukishanletea deal ya 500. Mm-hmm. Hiyo deal ndanunua na Lexus sikutaje. Um, okay so my so question is the the main reason in Manzo Kibera me am work is it because that ame una like wewe wewe ni manager mwenye maybe una hizo connections za kupata deals kubwa ama wewe una feel what's the main reason uh, Manzo Kibera kona story mingi anasema si let it deal anasema manager anafaa kukua kipara na vaa suti ah. unaona anasema Mm. anasema ati sijui manager anafaa naenda church unaona mm-hmm. okay unaona. So, na sasa niulize wewe as a manager niliona pia kuna ngoma mliko umetoa pamoja like maybe hizo ndio vitu zenye mwanzo wa kibera na feel ai tuko tunaimba na manager wangu ama ikuwe maybe you're forcing her into music na hawezi imba jo kama mimi mimi ukini force into music na ezalia <laughs> Unajua mwanzo wa Kibera hiyo mm. siku mingi ametakanga kuimba. Oh. Eh, so tulienda studio, nililipa studio. Hiyo project yote ile ni cost around 200k. Mm-hmm. 200k yote yeah, the audio. Wewe, the audio. The video. Okay, kuna producer ali producing ngoma anaitwa Obuar. Mm-hmm. Yeah, Obuar is actually one of the expensive producers in Kenya, unaona. Mm-hmm. So Obuar session peke yake ni around 30 Gs aya sessions watu wake kavas lazima mlipie sessions kuna mm-hmm. session ya Munira kuna session yangu kuna session ya Wambo Okay why did you decide to spend so much on that song Okay you know I'm doing all this to show Manzo Kibera mm-hmm. I am capable mm-hmm. Niko na una get like yani naweza na jaribu mali naweza you get okay. but sasa manze mm-hmm. hii pesa yangu ni kama itaenda na maji I think you must my you've been best of friends See obviously maybe you know where she lives. Ngokosha enda kumsaka saka machuo. Eh manzo kibera ni cheesy. You've been best of friends. Yeah. Na manzo kibera. Na unasema it's been a week ujai muona. Sasa si I'm sure kama mtu ni best friend wako from Kitambo, you're supposed to be knowing kwenye anaishi. Maybe unaweza ndo muangalie machuo. Eh manzo kibera kwanza mali anaishi hizo machuo man. Mm-hmm. Eh na hizo swag zangu za kibabi na hizo ah! hata eh Unaona? Wewe na bull ring yako. Mimi na hii bull ring yangu. Unajua hata tukimaliza interview naona anaingia kwa machuo mchuo. Mhm. Unaona nikijaribu nipige hata step mbili napata chuo kama tatu. Hata uwezi kwa sure ni wapi? Yeah, so yani mm-hmm. eh hey, manze. So wewe umesema hizo story about right now ni kama anaanza. Anaanza ni kama anatafuta manager mwingine chini ya maji ama. Manze. <laughs> Ungetaka kuambia manzo wa Kibera nini? Unajua it's not right. Mtu akifika eh. akifika amefika mali anaanza kuachanisha mwenye alianza na I don't know why hiyo story ya management ni nini why na happen eh miki tunataka kusema mm. message yangu tu mwanzo wa Kibera tumetoka mbali mm-hmm. eh, nimekulipia photo shoots nimespend pesa mingi sana kumbuka hizo vitu zote tumepitia unaona don't give up on me eh, ni unblock mm-hmm. ni follow mm-hmm. 
Nian block mbaka calls unaona you just drop things out yeah i mean kama 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 lazima ifike hapo mm. suti tutavaa hata ku shave tunaweza shave kidogo kitu ama pia ukubali apate manizo mwenye naweza mwenye shaizi machu apate deals mm. mbio mbio muko assistant what yeah. you are sometimes you have to humble ourselves ili vitu kubwa zikamu eh yeah, lakini sasa mimi eh yeah, ni suti tu tutavaa yeye yeah, alisema mm. kuongea niko sawa lakini mm. Appearance eh, 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 dread. dread is easy tutanyoa tunaweza kata kwa sanduku uh-huh. next time naweza zirudisha Okay Otila Black umesema pia unafanya muziki Hebu unaweza ambia ma fans please wanaweza pata muziki wako then you close the video eh, Okay actually me music is a hobby uh-huh. ni hobby nafanya uh-huh. eh, but channel yangu ni Otile Black uh-huh. Instagram ni Chali wa Kibera uh-huh. Uh, yeah na kama wewe ni best ya manzo kibera ongea na yeye manze tumetoka far kabisa yeah. okay guys tumekuwa na utile black it's been a nice time na yeye uh, i hope mta solve these issues na manzo kibera pia tu abai like that haraka tu bebe hata <laughs> yeah, hata also uh, my dream car so wow. itakuwa fit sana yeah, yeah. So manze hata unaweza try kumcall manze jumia many block <laughs> nikimcallata na namba random akisikia tu sauti yangu anakata anakata okay tutaona venye tunaweza do yeah okay guys you subscribe you like you share you hit that subscribe button to pick 70k very very soon till next time